Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am doing comparison of smartphones. I hope this video will help you to understand some similarities and differences of both smartphones. Friends, I would suggest to watch this video complete till the end so that you will not miss any critical information that I am going to tell you in this video. Before move on further specification, I would suggest you to hit subscribe button to get subscription of our YouTube channel. If you are watching this video from your mobile phone, then you may find bell icon just beside subscribe button. So don't forget to hit that as well. Friends, subscription to this channel is completely free. On getting subscribed to our YouTube channel, we'll get you update of every latest tech video once we release. Friends, you are watching Prostec, so let's get started. Friends, so starting with the Oppo F5 device, it works on Android 7.1 Nougat and powered by Helio P23 with 2.5 GHz octa-core and with GPU Mali G72 MP12. Whereas Honor 9 works on Android 7.0 Nougat and powered by 2.4 and 1.8 GHz octa-core aligned with the high silicon Kyren 960 chipset to increase processing speed, response time and battery life. It also comes with GPU Mali G71 MP8. Moving on to display, then Oppo F5 is 6 inches device with LTPS IPS Full HD display, having resolution 2160p by 1080 pixels and with 402 ppi pixels density. Whereas Honor 9 is 5.15 inches device with LTPS IPS LCD display having resolution 1920p by 1080 pixels and with 428 ppi pixels density. You can also find Corning Gorilla Glass 5 with Emotion UI 5.1 user interface. Talking about the internal memory then Oppo F5 comes in two variants. One is 32 GB with 4 GB RAM and 64 GB with 6 GB RAM and also supports micro SD up to 256 GB. 64 GB with 6 GB is available in red color only. Oppo has produced this device in gold, black and red colors. While on a 9, it is available in two variants of internal storage that is 64 and 128 GB with 4 and 6 GB RAM and also supports extended memory 256 GB but it uses SIM2 slot. You can find this device in Glacier Grey, Sapphire Blue, Midnight Black, Gold, Bluebird and Robin Egg Blue colors. If we talk about the dimension of Oppo F5, then it is 156.5 by 76 by 7.5 mm of thickness and 152 grams of weight with dual nano SIM support. Whereas Honor 9 is 147.3 by 70.9 by 7.5 mm of thickness, weighing 155 grams with hybrid dual nano SIM support. Friends, as Oppo says that Oppo F5 is a selfie expert device, therefore it comes with 16 megapixels primary camera with 1.6 aperture, digital zoom, auto flash, face detection, touch to focus and continuous shooting. You can also find geotagging, touch focus, face detection, panorama and HDR. It shoot out videos of 1080p at 30 frames per second as well. Oppo F5 also comes with secondary camera of 20 megapixels with 2.0 aperture for selfie shootouts. Gives you real time selfie as Oppo claimed. Moving on to primary camera of Honor 9, then it is equipped with dual 20 and 12 megapixels primary cameras with 2.2 aperture, phase detection, autofocus, 2x zoom and dual LED dual tone flash. It also comes with geotagging, touch focus, face detection, panorama and auto HDR feature as well. Honor 9 shoot out videos of 2160 at 30 frames per second. You can also find secondary camera of 8 megapixels with 2.2 aperture in Honor 9. Friends, Oppo F5 has positioned fingerprint scanner on back panel of the device and comes with light sensor, 
proximity sensor, accelerometer and compass. This phone also comes with GPS, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi hotspot, 3.5 mm audio jack, micro USB 2.0, USB on the go and 4G VO LTE support. Oppo F5 is also equipped with 3200 mAh non-removable battery as well. Whereas Honor 9 comes with fingerprint scanner and it is front mounted. It is also having GPS, Bluetooth, NFC, Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi Direct, Hotspot, DLNA, Infrared but there is no FM radio in this device. Honor 9 also comes with fast battery charging feature that can charge the device almost 40% in 30 minutes. It comes with Type-C 1.0 reversible connector and if we talk about the battery capacity then it is powered by 3200 mAh non-removable battery as well. So that was the quick comparison of both smartphones. Do let us know if you have any questions and doubt of the phones in the comment section below. As always do like share and subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.